Hello foodies, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna share my recipe for cauliflower risotto. This is a really versatile recipe that can be turned into all kinds of different variations. Stay tuned. <laughs> Start with a saute pan over medium heat and add two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Once that's warmed up, add in one medium onion diced, two stalks of diced celery, and two to three cloves of garlic minced. And you'll just keep stirring this here to soften the vegetables. At this point, really the possibilities are endless. You can add in mushrooms for a mushroom risotto or any other vegetables that you like to suit your taste. Get creative here. Once the vegetables are cooked down, add in three to four cups of cauliflower rice. You can use a frozen riced cauliflower like this one. You can also make your own by pulsing cauliflower florets in a food processor or grating cauliflower on a box grater. Keep sauteing that for a couple more minutes to soften the cauliflower. Add two tablespoons of lemon juice, or this is a great place to add white wine if you want to do that, and let that just cook for a minute to cook off some of the acidity or the alcohol. At this point, add in half a cup of vegetable broth, water also works, half a cup of coconut milk, three tablespoons of nutritional yeast, half a teaspoon of sea salt, and a quarter teaspoon of ground black pepper. And stir that through. Just let that simmer for a few more minutes to thicken up as the moisture evaporates. Stir it from time to time. It's a pretty quick recipe. After you have everything softened to the texture you like, add in two cups of chopped spinach. This can be kale or any herbs, anything green that you want to add or leave it out. And then just cook that for a couple more minutes until it wilts and softens down and then you are done. I can't tell you how often I make this dish for dinner. It comes together so fast. I like adding wild caught shrimp to it sometimes if I want some extra protein. The possibilities are endless. Customize this and add in whatever you like to suit your taste. And enjoy. This is so comforting. It's warming, it's plant-based, it's easy, and it's absolutely delicious. Please comment below the video if you try it out. I love to know when you try the recipes. Hit the thumbs up if you enjoy it. Share it with somebody that might also enjoy it. And keep moving your body, keep nourishing your body. Have an awesome rest of your day.